Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel and another episode of Blasted Oasis. So last night was the Horde Night, it went really well. Uh, we had no real issues other than we, lo we lost a set of bars, but I'm going to rethink a little bit of how that's laid out. Um, decide what we're going to do going forward because they're really going to pile up the door there and it's going to become an issue even like we're only on 16 zombies so uh, it's going to become like a serious issue if we're not careful. All right, we're going to head down to the second trader here. We do. Um, have a whole bunch of stuff to sell. Um, not sure. We'll think we'll get there early. So we... I don't know if I want to just throw this stuff in the bike. I think we'll find a place to mine. We're going to need gunpowder moving forward. It's the one thing I think we're really going to need. So I, I, I know where a coal node is or a couple of them are. Um, we need to find a nitrate powder node. Hopefully close to the second trader here. Or somewhere nearby. But we got a couple of jobs we might be able to pull off today too. I just want to make sure our inventory is emptied before we go off and do that. Uh, so let's get up over here. We're just going to go ahead and park here. Now we're going to have a look around the trader here. The M60 works really, really well last night. Uh, made a huge difference. Like a huge difference. We cleared that door pretty quickly. Um, I've got to decide what I want to keep the game settings on moving forward. I might just leave it on 16 zombies and leave the horde base as it is. I don't know. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below. How how much you want me to ramp up the difficulty on this. Because I can just make it crazy and then we can just do a really crazy horde base. But as it stands right now, it's actually not so bad. And with the M60, I think we can deal with bears fairly easily out here. Um... The only thing we really got to worry about is landmines <laughs> and not seeing them. Um, what building is that? Oh, I know what that is. That's, yeah, there's a dog in that building there, but I really need to find nitrate powder. All right, well, we had a look around the trader. No luck on the nitrate powder, but we did find a couple of these guys. So we got a bit of nitrate powder. Not much, 13. Oh, boy. Whole 13 gunpowder make us what four rounds isn't that awesome hopefully when we're out today i think we're going to go do these quests so once we're out today hopefully we'll be able to uh find some now trader's almost open i'm not going to go warm roaming around too much let's just drop this stuff in the uh bike here and he should be open all right now i brought the awesome sauce and stuff with me today in case we find something awesome in the uh <laughs> Get it? Awesome sauce for the awesomeness. Uh, see if we have anything awesome in the traders. I'll, I'll uh, go ahead and, and pick that up. Um, but if not, then we'll just uh, just deal. Getting used to it. We really need the military armor schematic, I think, more than anything. I'd like to find that in a trader or in some uh, stash somewhere. There you go. Okay, so we got Atom Junkies, Covert Cats, a health... Let's take the health bar and the Atom Junkies. And I'm going to buy a Jailbreaker just in case we encounter um, something today we need to open. Let us speak, Plus we got the money, so why not? All right, may I see your inventory, please? Please and thank you, Forge Steel. Let's have a look here. Okay, so Fireman's Almanac, 10% Hyperthermal Resistance... Shotgun Messiah, High Dismember Chance, Hof Harvest Coffins, Shotgun Ammo, Forged Steel, Sawed Off Shotgun Mod, Increases Projectile Spread. I don't want it to spread, I want it to take people's heads off. Um, raw Meat, Potatoes, and you don't got much, do you? Military fiber. I'm going to need that if I'm going to make military armor. So I might just buy that 20 gunpowder only, eh? Only 20. Any oil shale? No. Of course, now that I'm looking for it, he doesn't have it. We're going to buy his other supplies, though. Fence posts will buy. Okay, so let's go ahead. He doesn't have a lot, so I don't want to waste the awesome sauce. Let's just go ahead and use this. And then let's talk to him. Get rid of all this stuff. All right, what are we working with? 26,000. Nice. So let's go ahead and buy your fence posts because I know we want those. Um, 
We want to buy the we, it's only 650, so let's buy the books that we don't have. Structural brace. Um we've got I think we're okay braces wise. Oh, we can put it on here. Um Nothing there. Nothing there. We're gonna buy all your meat. We're gonna buy your potatoes. Wish you had corn, but you don't. Um nothing there. Not anywhere near as good as what we have. That's the stuff I sold you. Bucket, to take the gunpowder. We're gonna take his military fiber. And let's see what we got here. Forge steel, I could just go ahead and buy. We don't have a lot, but we might as well buy what we can. Early on, I mean, like early on, we'll be, i take that, let's take this. We'll be making our own later. But for now, it's like so cheap, right? Let's, let's lay off that. We can make, forged iron's a lot cheaper to make. All right, well, that's not bad. We'll go with that, I think. I uh, thank you too. All right, we got some missions to do. We're gonna do the far one first. Um, get those red. Let's modify you. All right, let's get going. I'm gonna grab some food here and drink before we go, just in case. Let's grab stock. That'll give us some water. And the, what does the pears give us? Crap by that. Alright. Go ahead and use both of these. Then we'll get out of here. We can just scrap this. So we made out pretty well. We came out on top, I think, after that Horde Knight money-wise. Eh, we'll just drop all this stuff in here. I'm gonna keep this on us so we don't forget to use it. Actually, let's go ahead and drop you in there as well all right let's go do the far mission first so this is for trader the first trader the second one is um, this is the clear actually let's do the fetch first that's gonna be really easy we'll just bolt in grab it and then get out and then we'll travel across to see what's on the other side of the world now Depending on how well we do today, we might be able to make it back, but if not, I'm fine with that if we stay over the overnight at the other place. Ooh, there's a bear there. Just keep moving on, moving on. I remember when I first started playing uh, Seven Days to Die, as soon as I saw the wasteland, I would turn around and go the other way. I mean, it was always more of a nightmare. Excuse me. It was always more of a nightmare back then because it was... Um, Full of landmines, dog like zombies and dogs were just like everywhere. You know, the bears were everywhere. But now it's like, yeah, you play one series out here and you're like, okay, it isn't as bad as you think it is. You just get used to it, right? It's like I said about playing on insane for so long. No one's following me. You play on insane difficulty for so long and then you you drop the difficulty down and it's like so easy, you know? Oh, I remember this place. Uh, where are we getting the supplies from? Upstairs. Is it on this floor? Yep, it's on the main floor. Alright, let's just... Uh, wake up. Not shot! Well, I don't know why you're grabbing your leg. Wasn't your leg I was shooting at, buddy. Alright, got that. Ooh, that's not bad. I'm not gonna read that. Grab some plastic while we're here. I'm not gonna read that because uh, if we if we do go robotics, we're gonna be putting points into robotics. And I think let me just double check here. So robotics inventor. Robotic sledge crafting. Can you actually, I guess you just have to find the, uh, I guess you have to find this, so we might as well read it then. 
I don't know if we'll ever get around to it, but it was like it's like one of those things where you're like, eh, I don't know if I'm really going to use it, but we might as well have it. I thought we'd be able to. Uh, where is this? Oh, behind there. I thought we'd be able to um, research it, but I guess you can't. All right, now I'm guessing the main loot for this place is in the upstairs. Okay, definitely use that. I should probably check if there's more nitrate powder in the kitchen, which there is. That's nice for later. Have a little bit of raviolis later. Some oleolis. Nothing. All right. We want to go for the main loot. Oh, hey, what's up, buddy? You can have some of the arrows back that I got from the horde last night. I hope you don't mind. Actually, we should probably take these tonight or today too. Tonight. Yeah, like we're coming back here tonight. All right, scrap these guys out of here. Let's take this out. All that for a tin can, eh? Well. And always get what you want. Okay, bookshelves. Just a backpack. All right. Uh, is there an upstairs to this place? Find out in a second, I guess. Okay. Um, oh, man. We're never going to make a machete, but let's use it. One of those things that you just, you have to find. Um, T-shirts. Alright, let's wrench these now. It's weird that this is tier 2. Doesn't seem like there's a lot here. I think this is the door to the basement, probably. It is. That's the bathroom. Okay, that's the upstairs. Alright. I may, bet you you regretted that, huh? You regretted that, didn't you? It's like, I'll just jump over the balcony and be a hero. You want to be a freaking hero too? Is that what it is? There you go. You're up against a hardcore player now, Bubba. Oh, you surprised the shit out of me. Oh, ho, ho. You caught a piece of me, too. One, two, three. There you go. That was nice. Nice little booby trap there. And there's the loot room. Where are you? Oh, there you are. Done. All right, let's loot this place. Not locked. All right. Ah, we'll take that. Level 5 gloves. That's kind of nice. We'll take that. Yeah, A little bit of ammo. What have we got in here? Nothing. If they're going to put those sandwiches in, they got to have more use than just like a handful, like a couple of recipes. Because they're really like... I know, I, you can make 10 to get like moldy bread or something to make antibiotics or whatever, but... I guess if you absolutely needed them, then they'd be good, but if you don't absolutely need them, like, I, I don't know. I don't even know why they're in the game. They've weeded out a few things, like the, the metal tin for making um, the uh, mines and stuff. 10% dam more damage at night, eh? Well, it'll be nice if we actually get into a... Uh, 
kind of a night nighttime series. Go ahead and scrap this. We got tons of water, so we don't have to worry about that now. Take this. We used one last night. Uh, okay. I know we can make those, but I think it requires corn to do it, and that's one of the things we're really low on, so I'd rather not. I would rather not be making them. Okay, coffee seeds. That's good. We can go ahead and scrap this guy. Right? We, yeah, we checked that. It's got, just got steroids for 50 in there, which we don't want. Sunglasses. Take that apart. We got to get moving if we're going to get to the second place. I guess I got to just face it. We're going to be there overnight. I mean, I guess we could roll back in the dark. It should be fine, I think. And scrap. I don't think we have enough storage space for all this. Take that. Uh, I want the dye out of this, though. Let's go and do this. This is black dye, right? Yeah. Take the black dye. We can ditch you, bring you. And then we've got... Do we have anything to put black dye on? Too bad you can't decorate your cigar. It would be kind of nice. Don't really. Uh, put the black dye on you for now. Uh, right. We don't need that. Take that. Alright, let's get out of here. I am done with this place. Now, we don't have a lot of room in the bikes. So we're going to decide what we want to keep and what we want to get rid of. Um, yeah, iron. A couple things can go in there. We'll leave this stuff in here. Don't really need that. Ammo can go in there. We definitely want to keep that. We're going to use these up, I think. Let's leave the iron out here. Sail, sail, sail. We can go ahead and scrap this. Pipe bomb we might use today. Um, God, I don't know. All right, let's use these guys. Oh, there's a biker coming. Let's go play with this guy. I want to see how well we do with our club against bikers when they're running. Come on, buddy. Still four hits. All right, that's fine. Let's get moving on to the next place. Now, I know there's a lot of concrete mix and uh, cobblestone in the basement of that last house we were at. I don't feel like going down there to get it. There's a dog and a bunch of stuff in there. And I'd have to use ammo. I don't want to do that. Where the hell is this place we're going to? Um, I should probably put it on the map, huh? Or else I'm just driving around for no reason. Which, if you watch some of my series, wouldn't be shocking. Don't know where the hell I'm going half the time. All right, we got to find the road out of here. Is this it? Ooh, looks like we got lucky. If it leads us to where we're going, that is. Okay, this road is really meandering. It's getting us past a lot of places out here, though. A lot of good looting places. And it looks like we're rolling into another town here. Now, I don't... hope this is a bigger town. I think we got a bird on us, too. It, it just ends right here. And picks up over here. Alright. What's up, buddy? You leave me alone. I, I'm in the middle of something here. No, we're not even close to the town. That was just a uh, couple of POIs, I think. No, maybe it was a town. It looks like there's a lot of buildings here. Kind of rolling up out of the fog. I'm kind of glad there's only one bird chasing us. Could have been like 50, I guess. The amount of distance we were flying. That's the one thing I miss about being in the... Uh, in the Greenlands, is you get a bird on you like this, if you fly around a bunch of trees, maybe we can do it here. You can sometimes lose them, because they try to get on you, and then they get caught in the trees and have to go up and around, and then they just get lost behind you. You get enough distance on it, you don't have to worry. All right, now is this in the... Where is this place? I think we lost the bird for a bit. All right, looks like it's up over this hill. Yep, and another bird. And it's not like I can get off the bike and carry it over. Come on, you can do it. 
No bears. No bears. That's a stone, okay. Where are we going, man? Holy crap. Passing gases. Is this actually uh, another town? It looks like it's another town. Yep, totally is. Oh, really? Audio? Auto. Auto. Alright, we've got a couple of them on us. Let's just deal with these guys. Oh, three of them. Three up, three down. Alright, we know this place. This should be an easy loot. Easy clear, that is. Uh, let's take those. We've got iron on us, so grab this. Alright, let's not mess around too much. We want to get back, I think, tonight. I don't like being caught out in the middle of nowhere. Especially if you got a lot of stuff on you. Because you can't really do any looting and things like that. Um, because you're loaded down, so it's like you're it's like a waste of time being away from home, you know. So let's hope we can just clear this place real fast. I think it should be really easy. This is a bed. We need the springs, so we'll take those. Uh, scrap you. We do need the springs for grenades, right? So, oh, hey, you heard that, did you? You didn't hear it last time. See, you could have had a silent death, but you opted for the worst of the two. You wanted to be a uh, freaking hero. All right, we're just going to loot the big boxes. Not going to bother with all the trash and stuff, although we're going to take these. We're going to have so much brass after this mission. Ooh, Seagar. How much is that worth? 120. Holy crap. They used to only be worth like a handful. It's going to be worth getting the recipe and then making a bunch of them if you can actually do it. I know they cranked up how much grass it takes to make them. But it's almost like completely worth um, going ahead and uh, making them. I'm going to drop the paper. We don't need that right now. I don't know how much loot we're going to get at the end here. Let's just go ahead and scrap this. See, you didn't hear me. Your buddy did. Ooh, take that. Like in the steel, man. Nothing down there. All right, what's this one? Ah, uh, breaching ammo. Switch schematics. I thought about doing a series where you're not allowed to actually uh, buy any tech skills. You actually have to find all of the recipes and anything that you need to make tech stuff. So you can't make wire fences. You can't make, you know, your bicycle. You can't make anything until you either find the schematic or the parts to make it. The other way to do it, we only if you find the parts. Just to make things more difficult. I still like the idea though of, and I, I think my next series is going to be the uh, the one where it's you have to um, buy your way out using using actual coin. Oh yeah, I remember this one now. Alright, a lot of cobble up here. We're out of cobble. Okay, let's see if we can just do the same thing we did last time. Leave the light off. I don't think he's right there, no. I see his leg. Right in there. Uh-huh. Bet you wish you stayed back there now. Really? You have the paper, though. What's in there? A purse? Purses are always like a... Oh, I got a beaker. That's nice. Purses are always iffy. You never know if you're going to get anything good out of them. Ooh. Can I get a shot at you? Damn it. Really? You like to say third time's a charm, but it really isn't. 
motherfucker gone? He's gone. Alright. Let's take this stuff. Ooh, there's a snack outside. Shotgun rounds, some more lead. Actually, just, just scrap this. Got lead on us. Get the light back on here. Yeah, last time we came through here, we had someone coming from outside. Alright, what do we got here? Gravedigger schematic. We'll take that and that. We got paper on us again, eh? When don't we have paper on us? Ooh, that's nice. Let's drop the paper. Thank you very much. Take that. Can this fit on something? Sure can. Watch, I'll end up selling it with the item on it. We have to go to the other trader, but we'll do that tomorrow. There's a guy in the corner here, I think. How you like that? I like them apples. Probably not too much, eh? All right, let's grab this. Then we're out of the we're out of the upstairs. From what I remember. Don't know why I keep checking this stuff. It's always going to have crap. Just leave it. Take this apart. Springs are always useful. Uh, where is... Here we go. Scrap those guys. We're not going to have any room to carry anything from downstairs. Alright, we'll deal with it when we get down there. Oh, we got another one of these guys. Oh, hey, buddy. Did they leave you locked in the bathroom? That's got to suck, huh? Sorry to hear that. Wow, one whole lead. Ah, uh, man. I, I got lots of oil at home. I don't need that. I can use it for making Molotovs, but I don't, I don't foresee going forever with Molotovs. I just don't see it. It's just not going to happen for us. Boom! Fuck, that's got to suck, huh? You were just sleeping in the closet. Some guy comes along, and he gets all he get, wakes up all groggy, like he's like, "Oh, what's going on out here?" Oh. Ah! I got caught on- No! Not that! <sighs> no comment. <laughs> oh, man. Let's hope there's some food in the kitchen. Desk is empty. I hear ya. Sleeping in there. Not anymore, you ain't. Nothing in there? I hear somebody outside, I think. Wow, we're making good time. Kinda shocked. No food? I think we're clear in here. That's the downstairs. And that's empty. Yeah, we used one. We got one. Can we use this again? Sure we can. Give us a bit of health back. Save a space in our inventory. Alright, see if we got any food in here. That's a little bit. That'll help. We can make our own coffee now, so there's no point in taking it. Take that, though. God, it's sad that I'm, like, looking for nitrate powder. Alright, forget the dye. 
Wow, like no food in here, eh? We should probably go out and dump stuff in the bike before we keep going here. Where is the bike? Out the back here? I think so. Let's go out this window. Is this where we are? That's where we are. Oh, it's a wandering horde. Alright, well, you guys do you. While I drop some stuff off in the bike here. Not a whole lot, but... Enough to free up a little bit of space. I guess we better deal with these guys. Or they're gonna break in when we're in there. Alright. Let's go. Let's get ready to rumble! Where's the rest of your team? I should grab all this chrysanthemum before I go. Oh, there's a snake. Getting all angry like. Definitely want the meat, so let's grab that. I don't think we've got any leather in the bike. I don't know where the hell the rest of that wandering horde would be. Alright, we don't need the leather. We'll just drop that. Let's get back inside here and finish this up. Uh, the downstairs is this way. Yeah! How you like that? Okay. A little bit quiet. Looks like they're all in here again. Of course, there's your friends. I hear them now. Ooh, there's like three of them back here. We get this guy? You sure can. Pull this guy. Make it his worst day. Uh, I know we can't shoot between there because we tried it before. He's gone. She's gone. And that's it. Time to loot up and get the hell out of here. Okay, let's go ahead and grab this stuff first. Alright, we got lock picking candy on us. So we're going to go ahead and use that in a second. Let's go ahead and open these boxes first though. That's unlocked. Okay. Just go ahead and use this just to save time. We brought it with us, so why not? Alright, now we've got a punk wandering around outside here. All right, what do we want to keep? What do we want to throw away? We can use the, get rid of that, get rid of that. I guess we can get rid of that. We've got a bunch of back at the, the, the base. Go ahead and scrap these because we can make them. Um, we've got a ton of sewing kits. So let's leave that. Let's leave this. Um, so let's go ahead and grab this, this, and this for now. The water we can probably leave too. Yep, yep. And we can scrap this guy for the iron. So let's go ahead and use the water. And drop the rest off here. Get rid of that. Alright, we got a pile of ammo here. 28 magnum rounds. That's a functioning workbench. Which kind of sucks. I don't want to take it apart. Okay, that's perfect because we can use this for the... Uh, yeah, man, we can use that for the um, junk sledge on Horde Knight. Let's repair this guy. Let's repair this guy. Repair this guy. Repair this guy. And yeah, I think we can go ahead and modify you with this. Perfect. All right. 
let's go back and get the rest of we can check you yet we did not check you okay we can scrap this and of course they heard us outside we'll scrap this and take the rest I think it's more than one too well they should be able to get in I mean I gave them an opening take this stuff it's in here oil we don't have room for it where are you guys oh you're on the flank well we need to go treat with these guys let's just drop some stuff in the bike here storage whatever we can fit in there ah, a couple things dude I'm over here there you are thank you for the free XP much appreciated all right let's take a cruise around this town now We've got time I'm interested to see if there's a trader here now, usually they're on the edge of town so let's go find the edge and we'll drive around there's a stadium here oh that might be somebody over there that's just a house is this uh what's her name no it's not okay nothing there Ooh, beep beep see how sturdy these bikers are oh it almost completely stopped us pretty sturdy that's a scrap yard uh, this is the shamway plant and this is munitions chest let's keep our fingers crossed we got a couple slots left so hopefully we can fit some stuff in here come on sure take that we're gonna take this stuff though A fucking bird he was that scared the shit right out of me over here asshole oh god damn it scared the crap right out of me this game man sometimes you're like you got it under control and you're like yeah man this is great no problems nothing's gonna scare me and then you get shit like that birds stealth up on you god damn I'm gonna have a heart attack All right, I could stop and grab this material but we're gonna head back home I don't see a trader here which is kinda sucky wait what's that Did that say open it does but it's part of an POI Shotgun Messiah place. Crack a book. Okay, so there's some good looting places here. I don't know if those are considered tier 2 or tier 3. I think they're tier 3. Oops. Yeah, it doesn't look like there's a uh, trader in this place. Let's hope I remember how to get home. It's definitely not going west, that's for sure. Ooh, we're running low on gas, though. Hey, what's up, Moe's? You should have no problem getting home. There's a pass of gas up here. We'll just stop and get some gas. Excuse me. Oh, that fucking bird. Come on. Let's kill this guy and we'll check this for gas. I should have let you burn out, but I don't have time. Empty. Alright, I guess we're wrenching this car. 
Unless it's got gas in it. You got gas in you? Got a pipe. Drop that. Okay, can we stick anything else in the bike? I think we can put the... Uh, yeah, we can put those in there. Engine, nice. As long as it didn't hit the ground. Springs, plastic. I'm sure we're dropping stuff. What do we drop? Mechanical parts. Mechanical parts. Bottle of acid. Alright, let's drop some stuff in here. It should take all of the gas, which I think is good. Storage. Ah, uh, man, really? It won't take any of that? Nothing? God damn. Oh, you know what we can get rid of? I'm sure everybody's screaming at that thing. Put the engine in there. Don't need you. We can pick up both the acid and the mechanical parts. Don't need the cloth. Alright, we got enough gas to get home. Let's get the fuck out of here. Is this another part of this town? We drove through here. I don't know if this is just like a smaller town attached to the main town or... Ow. Let's just drive through here and see what's up over here. Yeah, I don't think this is... Uh going to give us anything. I mean, there's a popping pills here. Uh, fire station. I think we came past this way already. Ah, another bird. He's going to follow us all the way home. Well, I'll worry about it when I get home. Another popping pills. Wow, this place has got a lot of great places to loot. We should set up a temporary base here and just come and loot this place. What's up, Dougie? This bird sounds really angry. I think this is our road. If it's not, well, taking this road anyway. Hopefully we lost him in the trees there. There's another bird. Look at this guy. He's angry, angry, angry. Okay, we're going this way. I don't know where we're going. I didn't check the map, but this is pointing towards home, so... Oh, he followed us through there. Ow, he hit me. Damn it. Oh, this is the right road. Fuck it. I should just stop and kill this guy. I just want to see how many birds I can drag with me home. Okay, here another one. There's two. Oh, dude. I don't know what you had for lunch, but it's not agreeing with you. The one thing I got to say I do like about this game... On, on a, like, unlike MMOs, when you get a mob on you, right, it reaches the point where it's like, okay, I'm outside my area, and then it stops following you and goes back to where it was. This game, these fuckers will follow you. No matter, I could, I'll, these things will follow me until I run out of gas. I love that. I love the fact that you can drag a massive horde across the world if you want to. It would certainly make, like, if you really hated somebody, and you are playing PvP... It would certainly make a horde night interesting if you had if you just drank a couple of mega crushes and dragged your massive horde across the map right to where the other guy was fighting and pulled them right into his area. I don't know if they would attack his base or attack you, but I th I'm sure as soon as you died, they would go after his base. All right, did I take a wrong turn here? Because I don't remember this. Or is this the town? This is the second town, maybe? I don't know. Let's have a look around here. We got time. Oh, we got another bird. It's three now. At least I think it's three on me. There's a cracker book here too. I may have lost the other two birds. I don't know. Gonna make a right turn here. And another cracker book. It's a smaller one though. This may be worth coming down to. Just take a day and kind of wander down here. I think we need to get the motorbike, though. One, so we can keep the birds off us. I don't think there's a trader around here anywhere. Uh, one, to keep the birds off us. And two, because it's got more storage. Or if we just come down just to loot books, I mean. Like, we could just avoid... 
we could just avoid um, doing anything but picking up books and stuff. Did we lose those other two birds? We may have. Can go into wall cart here too, though. Shamway Foods. I call it wall cart because it reminds me of the uh, the um, the POI and um, the compo uh, POI pack. Alright, it's officially night. We got lots of gas. I'm not worried. I think that bird may have given up on us. Ooh, this place is pretty cool at night, I gotta say. Like the wasteland? It's pretty darn scary at night. It's all Halloween-y and everything. Is that another? That's another one. We lost the birds. We didn't lose the birds. They were just a little farther back. I think they got tired of following me. I have to expect when I'm digging this shit up that I'm going to get attacked again. Wait, do I have room for this? I don't. Oh, fuck, Mo. Go away. Oh, he's, uh, feral. Not anymore, he's not. He's just a disgruntled employee. Uh, this episode might go long, I don't know. I'll be cutting out a lot of driving, so maybe it won't be. Uh, we got more guys up here. Let's put uh, that in there. We'll take this. And we'll put that in there. And then... Go ahead. It's risky to open this. Only because it takes 10 seconds, right? It's 10 seconds I'm not watching my ass. Come on. Ah, uh, we got some non-stackables here. So that, that's the steel spear parts. Do we have any in here? Oh, we got the animal stackable though. Let's take that. Really pushing my luck here. Alright, let's get home before I die horribly and the series ends. Whoops, sorry. Okay, I'm definitely on the wrong road here. Let's go this way. I'm definitely on the wrong road. I really hope this takes us home. We're north of our house now. I love the atmosphere. I mean, look at the atmosphere of this game. It's so awesome. Okay, this road's taking us around and back into the other town here. So we'll just keep going south on whatever road we see here on the left. There we go. Uh, nope. Let's not run over any fucking landmines. Ah, goddamn birds. Now I'm going back the other way. Get on this road and go this way. I know there's a road that connects. I don't know if this is it though. There's another main road down here that goes to the east. Ooh, that was a dog. Whoa! Ow! That was a cop! Uh, I don't know, something spitting acid at me. That was a spider monkey. What's up, buddy? Yeah, maybe being out at, at night is not such a good idea. Uh, was it here? Ow! Go away. I don't think this is it. Oh, piggy bank. Uh, we gotta go this way, I think. There's a white. <laughs> Let's not be outside. Okay, here's the uh, electronics shop. I think it's this way. Is it straight this way, though? I don't think so. I think it's one more this way. I could be wrong. I think I'm wrong. Got two birds on us now. No, I think I was right. I think it goes this way now. Yeah, this is the main road. Pretty sure it is. Yeah. That ain't bad. See? 
We're enjoying the, the beautiful ambiance of the wasteland at night with all its peaceful inhabitants just walking around being peaceful with each other. The only time they're not peaceful is when someone comes rolling by on a mini bike making lots of noise and they get angry at them. They're like, hey, this is supposed to be a quiet zone. Why are you riding your mini bike around? There's the trader. And I'm like, sorry, man. I tried putting a muffler on it, but the game won't let me make this thing any quieter than it already is. Ow! Ow! That's a lot of birds. <laughs> uh, I should rock the uh, M60 on these guys out of principle when we get home. Let's see if I can lose this bird around the tree here. Nope. But uh, I'm not going to. Because I, I know if I do that, then the be a bear is going to show up and that'll be it. Series ending bear attack. I fully expect this series to end by a bear, but we'll see. I think I better make. I think I better go ahead and make leather armor. I'm gonna have to get my uh, uh, my light armor crafting cranked up. I think. Now, I never did spend my uh, skill points from the, the uh, horde night, so I'll have to do that tonight. Maybe get we get leather crafting cranked up. All right, here's the house. Not gonna be able to bring stuff in. I think till the morning. Oh, well, maybe I will. I don't know. Don't see the birds. Alright, guys. We're home. I am going to end this episode here. I uh, hope you enjoyed it. That was kind of fun. I enjoyed uh, driving out there at night. Um, it was very interesting to see all the insane mobs. I, I know that was... What the heck's up with my mouse here? I know that was a cop back there puking at us. And then the white that we saw. So we know not to be out at night now. I knew it was around this area not to be out at night because of the uh, one night we had the white attack and stuff, but now I know it's everywhere. All right, so I'm going to end this episode here. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, drop a like. If you haven't subscribed, please feel free to subscribe. You can also drop any comments in the comment section down below. Until next time, we'll see you later.